Just a beauty, gorgeous day. What's up guys, how's it going? Mark from 408, we got Nala here. I just got back from Cuba and look at this. There is a for sale sign in front of the track. That's always a nice surprise to come, come home to. Yeah, weird. I, uh, you know, 15 years I've put into these thousands of videos, broke my back, almost died. And of course the bank will not give me a mortgage to buy an empty grass field. So I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do. Um, you know, I was hoping Facebook would pay me by now. I've been waiting for my payment for 19 months and I was going to use that, uh, you know, to hopefully purchase this, but yeah, kind of sucks. I don't know. Maybe I should start like a crowdfunding or something, but, uh, yeah, the car jump videos might be coming to an end. So. Uh, you know, always great news, eh, Nala? Always great news. Anyways, I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. But uh, Ty's coming over, uh, and we're going to try and, you know, make a, another video for you guys. And, uh, yeah, hopefully we can continue doing that. But uh, we shall see. We shall see. So, all right, carry on. Looks like someone had some fun down here. <laughs> Holy, what did I miss? Not a cloud in the sky. Holy, this is how hot it is down here. This is completely dried up. So we got Ty here. How are you? Pretty good. You haven't been, been down here been, in a while, eh? Been a, been a while. She's looking a little rough down here. She's due for a lawn cut. While I was gone, the lawn decided to grow about a foot here. So also I did start a GoFundMe page today. We're gonna try and uh, raise some money to buy this this place. This track is completely separate from the farm and everything. So, but yes, if you guys would like to donate, we would love that because I don't want to lose this and, you know, I want to keep it going and let people ride and eventually one day have my kids ride here. So hopefully we can keep it and uh, keep jumping cars for you guys because, uh, yeah, if someone else buys it, this is all getting leveled and I don't know what's going to happen. She gone. Yeah, we'll have to. Uh, eventually, I would like to buy this and the field above, build a jump up there, and then the cars jump downhill. That'd be pretty wild, eh? Anyways, um, we're going to see if this thing runs on engine oil today. Where's the key? Where's the key? That's my Ford key. It's unlocked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, might be someone living in there. There you go. There you go. Hey. Yeah, watch, we'll get you. Uh, I always love how we freaking this thing is just covered in rubber. Did you start? Oh, yeah. All right, uh, shut your door and drain the washer fluid. See how much washer fluid is in it? We need to drain it out. Oh, yeah. That's a good hefty amount. I don't think it's going to wash all the rubber off, though, that's for sure. Clean the old Team LTD off. General tire. I love my freaking general tires. They are the absolute best. And I do have a new set. We uh, actually have a couple sets that we need to burn off. So. All in time. Still draining? You're all out. Are you holding the thinger? That's it? Yeah, it didn't even wash the rubber off. All right, you can shut her off. Let's pop the hood, see what's under her. Let's see what the old freaking Jeep has here. <laughs> oh, the old Nitro. I have actually never been inside of a Nitro before this one. I never knew anyone that owned one. So, pretty decent little uh, machine though. High chance it is still in 4x4. Four four. <laughs> oh, he knows that. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> Probably should have told him. There's a 95% chance that, just park it right there. There's a 90% chance that you're still in 4x4. That's why she was taking off so good. <laughs> you're in 4x4. All right, let's pop the hood. This thing looks way better without fenders. 
Uh, shower down. Now that she's nice and hot. I accidentally did a burnout through that fender. <laughs> All right. Pull the old heat shield off here. I guess we don't really got to pull it all the way off. We just need this hose to put it right into the old 3.7 Hemi here. Pull it right off. Yeah, that was easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I guess we might have to tape up this one though. Here, you can put that down if you want. Come here. There you go. Beauty. The diesel? Well, we've done diesel, but I don't have diesel with me, so we're gonna use some engine oil. So basically, you just take the old wash fluid hose off, you poke a hole in there, not too big, just big enough for that. And then, yeah, this is either gonna completely stall out and screw us, or it's gonna smoke like a freaking <laughs> construction worker. <laughs> oh yeah, good. Make sure she's sealed well. You Direct injection. <laughs> All right, let's uh, go pick up some engine oil. You give it a try. <laughs> Put your seatbelt on. That would be a great call. <laughs> oh, this is a rough vehicle. Got a per lots of power. perfect view out the front window here. Yeah. She's very hot in here too. <laughs> All right, so yeah. I'll have to whip a few more going. Let's get her really hot. Let's see it. She whips a pretty good. No, nope. it's trash control keeps turning off. No. I don't know. Still has some good power in it. Not so dusty. You can't see anything. <laughs> Where are we? Come here. No way, dust. This freaking window. Oh. <laughs> Can't see anything. No. Alright, pretty good. Yeah, so oh, I was halfway up the ramp there. So we're gonna see if this thing runs on engine oil. I know they run on diesel. We've done that a couple times before, but let's do some engine oil. Let's, see she's gonna let's do it. Freaking yeah. Thing's still full. This guy, eh? He had one job. See what she's got here. Give her. Oh yeah, squirt gun. <laughs> oh, I got it in my eyes. Keep her going. It's gonna be a minute here. Here we'll cool down the engine. Keep her going. A little more. Does it just shut off by itself? Yeah, yeah just keep coming. Well, There's a tiny bit left. What's that? It's got like a safety. It doesn't want you to use too much, I guess. Anything? No. All right, I guess we're just going to have to mix it. Engine oil and... Uh, Washer fluid. She's full of oil. And drain, drain a little more out of the hose. A little more. So basically, you got to hold it wide open and just give her a little, give her a little squirts here and there. You might want to turn the car around too, just because uh, the wind's coming this way. Don't want to smoke you out. Just the neighbors. Hopefully, this thing doesn't light on fire again. I wonder if we need those hoses. New guy here, eh? Drive it like a rental. I guess the non-power steering doesn't really help. Oh yeah! What's the old Dodge got? So just, yeah, put her in neutral. Put it in neutral. See if it revs higher. You have to put your foot on the brake too. Yeah. Wide open, then just give her give her a couple taps. No smoke yet. 
Cleaning your window? Is that doing that by itself? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> she likes the oil, I guess. You're not touching it all. <laughs> well, give her some more. What's that? Just for a couple of seconds. Right it's not even smoking. Oh. Maybe we should take her for a rip. blew off it. You overcooked the belt, I guess. We had a fire. They ripped the whole pulley off. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we don't need to start a fire today, that's for sure. I don't know what the heck uh, was no, happening there. The no. Oh yeah, broke the uh, broke right off there. It run fast, it's pretty good there. Give her a little squirt. Just a quick half second. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's just milky, milky oil coming out. Eggs in there. Oh. Eggs. Oh, well, should we go for a rip? Yeah, might as well. Let's do it. <laughs> Is this how do you do the fluid? Yep, pull it back. It no, pull back, yep, like that. Like that. Windshield wiper stopped. <laughs> it's just turbo juice, I guess. <laughs> Thing runs great on freaking oil. <laughs> oh. uh, hilarious. <laughs> like, why isn't it smoking? Nothing, eh? Hey, it's just a Dodge thing. They're just used to running <laughs> on oil. That's how they're tuned. Nope. See how it just sticks like that? Yeah. Huh. Let's take another peek at her. That's weird. Still got lots of oil left? Oh, yeah. Crazy, eh? It's like extra juice. Yeah, I don't know. Let's have a look at the airbox. <laughs> well, there's lots in there. There you go. Oops. I don't know, we'll just keep running her, I guess. A little V6 hard at her. Bubbling away. 
All right, so we've decided we're gonna bypass this unit. We're just gonna drill a hole back there, put her straight in because I feel like all the oil is just, I don't know, just sitting there. I'm no mechanic, but I'll tell you how to run your car. That's for sure. I'll tell you how to break it. <laughs> I'm sure someone will tell us on here, oh, you're the, you know, the defibrillator capacitor, you gotta do this and then. It's like, relax, it's fine. Maybe we gotta reroute the old, uh, the old well, hole there. The wipers are trying. Yeah, yeah. They're just caught in another rubber. Guess we're gonna have to go back to the drawing board here. Reckon traction control. <laughs> oh. It's hot. It is hot. <laughs> I don't know. I don't get it. it works. Yeah. It doesn't work. Yeah. Let's have another look under there. Hey, it likes the oil a little bit. Must love to run on oil, these dodges, I tell ya. <laughs> you gotta brought the old tools today. We got the old DeWalt set up here. This stuff is amazing. I don't know where all my batteries went. I think I decided today was charging day, so. Oh yeah, we're good. Good? Gravy. There you go. Fire away, I trust you. Trust you with a drill. Just don't drill into the battery or the rad. Yeah, I think if I uh, just put it right back there, uh, should be good to go. Beautiful. You make it look so easy. Suck a little rubber and plastic in there as well. She's gonna fit. Yep. Perfect. This thing better be freaking smoking or it's going to overheat and we don't have any water down here. So, All right, fire it up. Right. Fire away. I just want to see some damn smoke. Is that it's too much to ask for? Look at the grooves in the tires. Oh, did I put it back in park? Yep. There's no one to start now. Nope. She's too hot. These cars and all their safety mechanisms. There's a lot, these yeah, days. there's a lot of safety stuff on this one. What kind of Christmas tree we got on the dashboard? Lightning. We might uh, might have killed the battery as we uh, blew the alternator belt off, but thank God I got two boosters in the truck. Noco is always to the rescue. Just doesn't like us today, eh? Safety things. Junkville. Junkville. I don't think we killed it. We drove it over here. Not even trying to. Yeah, I think it's just a sensor. <clears throat> Might have to just call our day and finish this another day. I don't know, frick. We don't have time to let it uh, cool down here. All right, that's the plan then. Dang! I thought we were gonna make her smoky. Smoky, oh, smoky. I was excited for the smoke. How'd you get so much oil on your shoe? I know. <laughs> it it's, happens. A, it's a struggle these days. Uh, right? It is. Uh. It always happens to me. All right, well, maybe we'll continue this tomorrow. Sorry, guys, but uh, Dodge sucks.
how's nuts out? How are you guys? Continuing on, just me today. I was just doing some stuff around the house. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna run out to the farm and try and finish this video. So Dodge Nitro, we're gonna inject some oil into it and see if it uh, lights on fire or blows up. I was doing some hedge trimming at home today. The hedges have gotten pretty big. So this is only load one. But uh, yeah, I was using the DeWalt. This thing works absolutely amazing. I've only used it twice, so it's still pretty clean. And I got the uh, power stack on it, which also works pretty amazing. Oh man, oh man, oh man, look at this cooler. Definitely keeping the drinks cold today, that's for sure. So I'm gonna unload this and then, uh, yeah. I brought my drone and GoPro since I'm running the solo mission today, but I think it's gonna do well. Or it's gonna completely stall it out and it's never gonna start again. Or it's gonna overheat and explode. I don't know, but we'll find out in a few minutes. Bumper city. <laughs> so hopefully she's cooled down from yesterday. It is quite hot today, so it probably will overheat again. Quick update, we basically moved the hose from the front of the box there to behind it, so it goes straight in. This thing is full of oil, uh, and we ripped the one of the pulleys off there and it lit on fire. So as you can see, she's broken off there. So we have no alternator anymore, but hopefully the battery's still charged. So I'm gonna set up the drone and GoPro and then fire this thing up. Hopefully she fires up and give her a whirl for hopefully a minute or two until uh, it overheats or dies again. Here we go. It is not well in here. It's about thousand degrees. Start up. All right, let's see what she's got. Still do not see anything coming out. Am I doing it right? <laughs> that is odd. Come here. All right, we're gonna have to go back to the drawing board here for a second. I have no clue why it's not doing anything. I pulled the hose out, I shot some oil. So there's there's some coming out of it, one right there. Um, yeah. Any ideas? Try another spot. A little farther down the pipe. All right, I have no faith in this still. You'd think it'd be bogging out or something. I see no smoke back there. Well, that sucks. <laughs> what are we supposed to do? Definitely a lot of suction through there. Tested her again. She's pouring out pure oil now. Come on, girl. Oh, yeah. She's smoking. Not much. All right. Don't stall out on me. I gotta throw the drone up. So, she's not a crazy amount, but it definitely smokes a little bit. <laughs> she doesn't like to run well either, that's for sure. But it worked, finally. Yeah, I don't know if uh, the oil's too thick and it just doesn't want to squirt out too well, but she did smoke a little bit. But anyways, we're gonna wrap this up with a nice little burnout. Get her really smoking. Hopefully she starts, because it is definitely overheated again. Got some good noises. Whew. She did not like that one. 
<laughs> Just bubbling away. He did not like that one bit. Oh man, this thing is hot. She can all pop. I probably shouldn't stand near it at all because, you know, in case it blows up. Oh man, what a shift. What a shift indeed. Well, sorry that wasn't more exciting for you guys. I guess we got to use diesel as, uh, as fuel instead of oil. Oil worked all right. It seemed to work better when it was under a load. Like trying to do a burnout, but still, I wasn't that impressed. I don't know. These Dodges are too good, I guess. They're too bad. Too crappy. Anyways, thank you guys for watching the video. Enjoy it. I did set a link below. Hopefully, we can buy the track. Probably not going to happen. Hopefully, just no one buys it in general. So, anyways, have a fantastic day. We'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.